All right ladies and gentlemen as your boy me does not have the luxury to try out the new Mr Beast X Prime which means Mr Beast X Logan Paul X KSI is new lunchly wait is it lunchly or lunchables i don't know i'm from india so i i don't know either of them apparently one of them is an og and people have hated on Mr Beast Logan Paul and KSI to have copied them uh and as i do not have the opportunity to try those let's react to asman gold trying them and giving us his verdict of how they actually taste so uh it's time for a reaction video again so make sure you guys subscribe 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 okay let's 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 move on to the reactions what the hell is that face that bad oh my god it's a, it's actually bad how do they it's nachos i see nachos i can't even tell the fucking difference oh i'm oh. sorry so today we're going to be I, i mean that does it that's it i don't have to react to this video anymore Apparently, lunch Lee and lunch Abul are the same, and lunch Lee is the one by those guys. Lunch Abul, lunch Abul is the OG one with Capri Sun. I know Capri Sun. Apparently, it's it's God tier. So pairing the prices or not prices, excuse me, the uh, taste and taste. how these different uh, and prices. Uh, what do you call it? what is these like MREs? I mean, I feel like that's MREs. for. Uh, that's for the military but basically <laughs> how these kids. like kid snack packs yeah. really compare with each other so uh hopefully i don't get food poisoning uh hopefully. they sent these to me uh i i'm not paid to do this oh um we're just going to do it they simply sent we're going to do it we're going to try oh. it out so we have okay, three okay. different kinds of lunch lead that they have okay. sent me they sent me fiesta nachos turkey okay. stackums and the pizza Pizza. So, I went to Target and yeah. I got the pizza, turkey, and nachos. and nachos. Okay. So, we have all all three kinds here. Let's move this all back a little bit. All three kinds here and of we are going to energy. one for one yeah. each one of these types of food and we're going to see which one is better. The pizza? Okay. Well, I I do think that it is in fact the pizza. Maybe it's a pizza, no, I'm not sure. No. This is sponsored absolutely no. not. Which one do we want to do first? Seat. No. I think no. Packed pizzas are the worst. Trust me, I ate a lot of them and I became fat during COVID. So it's it's bad. It's very. Let's do the nachos first. The nachos yeah, seem okay. like very easy. One nine hundred and three. But last. And does okay. this have calories? So yeah. the Lunchables has four hundred and fifty calories. By the way, I, I'm I'm just going to like forward in the middle. If you want to watch the full video, the link to this video will be down in the description. He just talks too much. He 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 talks. He talks too much. I I can't react to everything. So if you want to check it out, in the description. Okay, calories. Calories. So the Lunchables has four hundred and fifty calories. Okay. The Lunchly has three hundred and sixty calories. That's good. And it then. even has there on the front of the box here yeah. the Lunchly box. 400 milligrams of electrolytes and if you didn't know it that's what plants crave so <laughs> we've got right here we'll go ahead and we're going to open up the lunchly box we're going to see what we oh, have to look at here and okay. old yeah see he just the just leave okay. take it out right here yeah and we've got ourselves the Nachos. leave no crumbs from leave lunchly no crumbs. right here and it says use by december 2024 and you oh. have the bottom here you've got clearly the nacho cheese yeah. the red stuff and then the, the nachos feastables themselves well. and there's a little feastable bar yeah. inside of there and, and so we've got it right there and then also inside of the lunchly box it's we prime. have Ooh. what a surprise prime energy yeah strawberry prime energy. banana prime Ooh. energy prime and by so the way. this is what you're getting okay. out of one prime by the way is overrated piece of shit I tried it one year back. I still have Prime. Like I I ha I have undrunken Prime which has been expired since one year sitting in my fridge. Still, 
it is stale i think i think fungi is growing inside that prime bottle but i still have them so if any of you guys want to watch a video where i showcase how expired prime looks like leave a comment or something because because i literally have like 8 to 10 flavors of prime expired prime just just sitting there don't know why actually yeah. right here now we'll open up the lunchables prime is let's take shit. a look at what's inside the lunchables okay Um I will say that this is yeah. already a point for lunchables Why? because I don't want to have to pull off a plastic wrapper in order to open this yeah. and this just has this thing here. However, I don't know if that was just because they were sold that way um mm -hmm. based off the fact they're being sent to like individual people, right? Yeah. Maybe. And so we'll open up the lunchables thing and we have once plastic. again oh, we have a Kit the cheese mm. right here. We'll compare it one for one, yeah. right? Exactly you have the cheese the here and the cheese here. It's almost this one here is lunchly. This one yeah. here is lunchables. Yeah. And it has inside it a Kit Kat. Kit Kat bar. And it doesn't say anything on the front other than the fact that it is the food. Yeah. So there we go. Copied one for one. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's not really a whole lot you can do with nachos. And of exactly. course, we have oh, the, the, goat, the goat Capri Sun fruit Capri punch. Sun. So there we go. Capri These are the two different goated. meal options. And yeah. um, we'll go ahead and yeah. we'll take this. Yeah. Yeah, um, that's just like taste it. Get that. How about that? Yeah, look. look. Um, is when I'm fat. Okay. It's pretty bad. It is bad. Prime Prime is not good. Trust me, it's not. Okay. Good. Smells fine. It's strawberry banana. I, I didn't taste that flavor, so I can't tell. But normally Prime is. <laughs> What is that? What is he went for the second sip? It tastes like um like wow processed sugar this unlocked a core memory uh-huh it tastes like if you're drinking a a slurpy from 7-11 oh but it's not a slurpy anymore because it's melted it's basically sugar that's, that's what, what it said. tastes like yeah it's processed sugar it's okay Uh it's not something I would probably drink the entire thing of. Exactly. But that's it. Kids love it. Yeah, it's very sugary. I'll have one more sip. It's sugar. Mm. It is, it's literally sugar water. Way too sweet. It is extremely sweet. It is. And I can tell that the more I drink it. So now we're going to go ahead oh, and we're going to try the Capri Sun. Capri. Oh. oh fucking this thing banks. Cold Capri Sun. Okay. Hmm. Oof. Come on. <laughs> I'm going to be real? Yeah. Maybe it's nostalgia? Yeah. But it's better. I like Capri Sun a lot more. Totally. I do. I like Capri Sun a lot more. Yeah. But I am also a kid that grew up in the 90s and this is what we drank. So, I, I can say no I I am very much biased in that regard. No, no, no. I drank it once. It's way better than Prime. Mm. I mean, I I think it's more unhealthy than Prime. I I just point Delicious. we don't know. We don't know. Maybe Prime is unhealthy. Okay. Who cares? So, now let's go yeah. ahead and let's try the actual food itself. Yeah, the actual natural. Let's start back and start forth with this one. Off actually, I guess brought my spoon. Okay. So we all So, eat the, eat the thing. Right, where's the I'm just going to Sure, okay, I'm, I'm, good. I'm sure. Kit Kats taste like um Kit Kats. I will eat this, but not right now. Uh, okay. But we will take one nacho Everyone here. Knows. Everyone knows what Kit Kats. And Kit we're going to take a look like. and try it with the food. Yeah. Okay. You guys see it right here? Yes, we do. Here we go. Yeah. Salsa we're going to try the consistency? Yes. The consistency It's for good. this is quite watery. Oh, it is. But okay. there's still definitely a degree of residue there. Mm -hmm. And you can clearly see that it did attach to it. Uh I live in Texas. Uh oh, part of Texas used to be Mexico. And so we have a lot of Mexican restaurants here. Okay. There are some that are here that are like this. Okay. Eat it then. The watery nature of it does oh. not mean that it's not authentic or bad. Okay, just just eat the thing. Yes. I don't think the salsa dip Why does he eat like that? Oh, 
Oh. Oh, he rolled his eyes It's back. not that great. Okay. Okay. It's... It's bad. It's okay. No, it's right? bad. <laughs> it's, it's bad. And also, by the way, I do eat with a... Uh, I do eat like a rat. Yes, you I do. have no back teeth. They've all rotted out. Wow. Literally, no back teeth. He's like this. So, if I eat weirdly, there is a reason for it. Okay, noted. My bad. Now, we're going to try okay. and check the cheese. Che the cheese one? Here we go. Bad. The cheese one would be nice. The cheese is also kind of wet. Cheese seems fine, but it's more watery in nature. Smells like, uh, basically cheese. Nothing wow. too special. <laughs> okay. Let's try this. Water cheese is nasty. That's what people say. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think it's better than the salsa, though. I can, in fact, confirm yes. that this is cheese. Oh. Or at least it tastes like cheese. <laughs> okay. Combine them? I don't want to. Oh, no, no, no. Don't. It's okay. Yeah, it's all right. Like, I never got these when I was a kid. I didn't really like the, um... I didn't really like the nacho ones very much. Okay. I'll get one more of these and just get an idea of it. I'm oh, going to do both of them at the same time here. He did mix. It's no difference. The cheese one dominates. Yeah. I'll say the only thing that's noteworthy about this is yes. that the um, salsa has a better, has a good aftertaste with, oh. uh, with Lunchables. Okay. Wow. Overall... I don't think it really tastes that good. <laughs> it's okay. Shock. It doesn't really taste that good. Yeah. How much out of 10? I don't know. Read it. Come on. And now we'll try... Oh, okay. The Lunchables. Yes. Or, sorry, the Lunchly. Lunchlies. So this is made right here. And I will also try Feastables. I've never had Feastables before in my life. Same. This will be the first time. And I would open it on stream, but I don't want to mess up. Not really ready for that. It's one of these, like, special packages. Special packages. Okay. okay. Only 80% I'm sugar. also going to have to smell this. If it smells problematic, I'm going to barely even eat just a tiny bit of it, and that's it. Okay. It's not going to kill him. Probably. And give me one second. Let me throw this away. Oh, okay. But I think the cheese... I think this is okay. I think the cheese, cheese it definitely a has a more noteworthy smell. Okay. I guess we'll know those, in a few hours wait, what... If, if, if you are an Indian like me, don't those nachos look like banana chips? From here. They look like banana chips. They don't look like nachos. Whether that's a good thing or not. So, the first thing we'll do is we're going to try out the feastables I try them okay. easily but they seem to basically I mean they're basically fucking corn chips right guys I mean what, what are we talking about here they look like banana chips um so we'll go ahead and we'll dip it inside of the uh, the red sauce here yes I think hmm uh, it looks decolorized the cheese from lunchy there's no way this little amount could give me food poisoning right there's like no way there is, there is actually. Instant poison. Imagine, imagine, he just goes, okay, and dies. But that won't make a one hour video. Both are bad. Yeah, or it's literally the same. It's basically the fucking same. See? It's the same. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah. Oh, I like, can't- I'm I can't, sorry. I, I can't wait <laughs> Pretty for much him. the same thing. I can't, I, I can't wait for him to try the ice pop. <laughs> it is, it's I'm, pretty much the same thing, it's, guys. It's I'm sorry. Worst. It's the worst. But it's okay, but like, you know, that's it. So we got uh, aftertaste. The Lunchables um, salsa has a better aftertaste. Mm. It does. Mm. Okay. But the basic taste is about the same. 
and now we have the cheese. Now, as you can see with this cheese, this it's cheese is a bit wider. Yeah. And uh, it's not quite as yellow as this cheese. This is like the more generic cheese. This is the more uh, Mexican styled queso cheese. At least we have that a lot here. So now we've got the cheese here. Okay. The cheese, more. I will tell you, I with the lunch lead, yeah? does have a more satisfying consistency to dip in. I, th okay. I think it tastes the same anyway. Oops. Okay. It doesn't, yep, that doesn't really matter. Put a little bit more cheese on it. He, he doesn't eat. eat. There we go. Tastes the same. Lawsuit didn't come. <laughs> how, how long does he eat like a... Okay, he's gone for the Lunchables. Just to x speed by the way. What's going on? He, he ate for two minutes. Speak. Did, did it shut his vocal cord? I can't okay. even tell the fucking difference. Okay. So there we go. It's, it's I'm sorry. The same. I can't even tell the fucking difference. You know what I think? I think Mr. Beast bought a few Lunchables factories without Lunchables knowing them to Lunchly factories started putting his own label and started selling it that's, that, that's, that's what I think happened that's what I think happened like they're basically the same like I, I really I, I, I now listen yeah. my taste buds have been um uh um like chemically uh, like, uh, damaged, right? Yeah, okay. But, like, I drink... I can eat a raw lemon, and it's just like a normal person drinking water. There's something wrong with my taste buds. So... So, so for me, these are about the fucking same. They yeah. are. They're pretty much about the fucking so same. This review I will pointless. say that the Lunchables smell better. That could be because this was left out on my door. And I didn't get them until uh, noon, and it could have arrived at 7 p.m. Uh, 7 a.m. I guess we'll find that out in a few hours if I'm throwing up or not, right? Yeah. So, yeah. Um, okay. I would say, which one did I like eating more? Which one? I think it got... It's, it's the same because of Capri's... I, I, think I, I really better. hate to do this, yeah. but I could not give less of a fuck. I would say the Lunchable. Oh, the. Oh my god, I forgot about the Feastables. Even oh I forgot god. about the Feastables. Oh my god. You're right. Thank you. Thank you. Mr. Beast is in chat. Okay. You, even I we forgot. We have the Feastables right here. Yes. This is feastables. the first time I have ever eaten Feastables. I am still. It says this unit is not labeled for retail sale. Okay, so only through lunch leave. I am telling you, Mr. Beast bought Lunchables factories. Okay. Okay. I just had to check to make sure it hadn't expired. It's milk chocolate. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. We're going to open it up. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> so, we have... Wow. That's it's smaller. just like a Hershey's bar, but yeah. instead of saying Hershey's, it says Feastables. <laughs> what a great idea. <laughs> Alright. Let's take a look at it. It's small. Smell the chocolate. Okay. Smells okay. Dairy milk is. I'll break it in half. Oh, he ate the whole half. Yeah. Okay, he he chews for a long time. Let me. See, I told you. Look. We're not going anywhere. Come on, Grandpa. He still... It's chocolate.
I just saw this man chew for one minute in two x speed, so it's two minutes for him just to say it's chocolate. This guy is the best reviewer ever. It's chocolate, he says. Yeah, it's chocolate. Um. The chocolate is not really, really good. The chocolate, it's if I had to explain what is the chocolate like. Yes, please. The chocolate is like, if you've ever had, you ever go to the uh, the grocery store yes, on I like did. a holiday? Yes, we And did. like you get like a big Easter bunny, like my dad got one of these for me. Like a big, big chocolate thing. And then like you eat the chocolate out of there. It no. look and it's like a lower quality chocolate generally than like if you just buy generic chocolate. Um, that's pretty much what it tasted like. I like Hershey's chocolate. I love chocolate. Um, you can it? tell that I love it because I have five teeth left. Yeah. So yeah, I'm a very big chocolate enthusiast. But if we're Kit really Kat comparing value here, we're looking at Kit Kat versus Feastables. Yes, Kit Kat is. I think that, like, I I've had Kit Kats before, and I'm gonna have nice. another one right now because they're really fucking good. Oh my god, he, he chews again. Hmm. Please don't don't be like it's it's Kit Kat. The piece of chocolate is not bad. Yeah, but this is better. It's not bad. It's not great. I would say that it's, it's pleasant to eat. It's mid as a tad says. But if I went to the store and you had a would choice. I choose to buy Feastables chocolate? No. Over the other brands. I don't really think so. But okay. if somebody gave me a Feastables, I, I would eat it. it. Okay. Great. Is that so it's bad. Okay, let's let's move on to the next thing. Difference? Yeah, I I feel like it's about the same for me. The uh, same. Nothing really too crazy. Okay. And we have the. Oh wait, did we just do a madness? Nothing in. I want to tell you. Okay. And My we're gonna open this one up first. Two front. Okay. This is actually the one that I'm most afraid of eating. Uh huh. And I want to tell you guys. This won't expire. It's, it's just crackers and cheese. Why is it empty? There's like nothing in here. <laughs> they gave him four crackers and four cheese slices. Wow. Lots of air. Four components right here. Okay. Open this up. Ooh, and you have Jesus. four components right here. And the oh. fourth component is for a Reese's peanut butter cup. That's that's crazy. Now I gotta tell you guys, I really, really, really like Reese's peanut butter cups. They're like my yeah. favorite. Yeah. So uh, this is gonna be a little bit of a bias here. I'm sorry to say. Everything is going. And to so be we've a bias. got right here. Obviously, there's the uh, the, cheese. the cheese and everything. If it. It's the same. It's just like. Yeah, I want him to taste ice pop. Okay. It's it's bad ice pop. All right, let's try it out. What no. flavor is it? This flavor is ice pop. Ice pop is the worst. Smell it. It has the consistency of like coconut water. It looks like coconut water. All right. Drink it. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> All right, all right, we're gonna do it. <laughs> oh, he went for the second sip. It's bad, isn't it? Um. Oh! 
Uh, well... It's too sweet. I can see... I'm trying to think, what, what do I think about this? It's bad. I'm trying to think of, like, how I can describe the taste. It's bad. The taste is a it's lot like, like... It's like a medicine. Uh, it's a lot like... A medicine. If you were to melt a popsicle and then drink it. No. That's basically what both of these prime flavors have been like to me. They're like melted candy. Exactly. So it's like it's like a but syrup. Yeah, yeah, it's something it's like, like that. Yeah, that, that that's that's pretty much it. What do you guys have? You guys had this? Do you guys yes. think that's accurate or not? I mean, it tastes more like medicine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, way to describe cake, it. That's my best way that I can describe this. I don't know. Now we're gonna start with Lunchly here. Okay. okay. Open the with box. Exactly six of six. these wafers here. Six crackers. So there's three here, and then there's also three here. Okay. That's it. That's all you get. You get six of them. I mean, with the cheese, it's. Let's it's compare fair. this with Lunchables in terms of the size of the okay. meal. Up Lunchable. At also six. Uh, so we've got three it's here and three here. Exactly. Six the same. with both of these. Okay. It's exactly the same. Now, what we're going to do is well, we're going to try... The lunch leaves. Yeah, I mean, I guess you could kind of say this tastes a little bit like turkey. So you have the cheese here. This is the lunchly, okay? This is lunchly right here. Yeah. So we're going to put the... Uh, we're going to do the normal <laughs> thing. Yeah. Uh, we're going to have one of the... Yeah. Put the cheese right on here. Yeah. Eat it. We're going to get all three of them at the same time, right? Yeah, it's ham and cheese. Yep, okay. absolutely. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and try it out. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay, just taste it. I mean, if you die, your parents can get a lot let's of money it. suing these guys, so... Oh, he chews for a long time again now. Oh. One year later, he's still chewing. Eh. It's all right. Eh. It's okay. It's I not crazy good. I think Prime It's all right. Him. I think it's decent. Coolest minus 10 HP. How many stats is it giving you? Minus I don't know. I guess we'll find out soon. Minus 10 HP. <laughs> so yeah, good thing it isn't salad. I guess so. So it was okay. okay. I, I I feel like um process it, man. Come on. You know, like if you go to Costco or Sam's Club. And you get like one of the really big deli platters there, and it's like twenty dollars, and it nice. weighs like fifty pounds of food. Yeah, yeah, it tastes kind of like that. Where it's not like the quality is like really that good, but okay. it definitely I can if if you gave that to me and you said what is that, I would be able to eat that, and I could probably tell you that it was turkey. Oh. Yeah, oh, I, I could I, probably I could it's say that it's turkey. Turkey, okay. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the Lunchables. Yes. It's interstuck together, whereas the cheese with the Lunchly is not, and they're all in their own individual slices, yes. and it causes the cheese from Lunchly to be a little bit more, um, like hard. It's like the cheese is a bit harder. Got it. Okay. Oh. I will say this definitely smells better. Dry? Oh. Yeah, that, that's the word I'm looking for. Dry. Okay. So now we have our Lunchables. This is the Turkey Lunchable. Here we go. Let's take a look at it. Oh, here we go. Come on. This one's better. Lunchables is better. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. I think Lunchables is better. Okay, they couldn't copy this. Why is it better? 
Clank. The cheese has a much better aftertaste, and so does the turkey. I yeah. think that it smells better, and I think that one of the reasons why it has that better aftertaste is, is because the cheese is stuck together, and so yeah. it's maintaining, it's not getting like dried out as much, versus the lunchly cheese where it's like kind of in its own, like there's like two or three of them that are stuck together, but these aren't stuck together. Yeah. They're like kind of this way. Okay. And so I really think it's the Ooh. cheese that makes the difference with uh, with Lunchables. So one point for Lunchables. Then. However, I do want to say something. Yeah. I don't think this sucks. He likes ice pop. I don't. I think the prime is pretty good. Yeah, it's decent. No. Yeah. I, I, I think the prime that, that is being sold in USA, they are adding some drug in it. So people say it's good because ice pop is the worst. How? I mean, grape is the worst, but ice pop, it, it's not good either. Interesting paid actor. No, I, I really, I don't think it sucks, but I would say, which one do I think is better? I think the Lunchables are better. I do now invert it. You think so? Right. It's an ad. Yeah, of course. Compare <laughs> the turkey only. Uh, honestly, I don't want to put another piece of that meat in my mouth. Like, I'm actually, you guys might not believe this, but I'm actually extremely, um... Imagine. Like, squeamish about he, eating it. Imagine. He got a paid sponsor from both of them. That's the reason he's saying both are better. Anything that, like, could be contaminated. Like he's saying both are worse, but he's saying both are the same. ...it or problematic. And because whenever I got this, it wasn't entirely, um like super cool, mm -hmm. like it was just cool and not cold. It makes me oh. nervous to eat more of it. And so I'm okay. whoever has the preservatives and like a shark, drink for drink myself. One, two, so at this. Mm. Oh, he chews now. This is a good part right here. Hmm. You know what's crazy? I guess it was in the refrigerator. You know how like the bottom, the middle bottom of the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup always get stuck to a wrapper? Yeah. This one didn't have that happen. Mm. Okay. There we go. Mm. Let's look. Wow. The candy I've eaten for my entire fucking life is actually good. What a shock. No. What a shock. Mm. Overall? Overall, I will say one suppose is better. Okay. Mm-hmm. Good. To me. Yeah. I like it more. But, but this is not bad, right? Like this shit where they're spitting it out and Mr. Beast's like, nah, nah, shut the fuck up. What are you doing? That's just for promotion. Oh, shit. It's not that bad. But what are you talking about? Both of these types of food are made for mass consumption. Yes. None of them have any type of extreme taste. Yes. They're basically just the most vanilla type of food that you're giving a seven-year-old because you don't want to make them a home-cooked meal, okay? That's what it is. They like whatever you give them. Let's go ahead and throw this one away. Okay. And I of flame, I am potassium, excited to see pizza. gum, Arabic, fate. Okay, let's, let's hear. Let's hear what ingredients these guys have. Holy shit. Okay. Water, citric acid, dye, potassium, phosphate, natural flavors, sucralose, ace of flame, potassium, gum, Arabic, ester gum, D-alpha, taco feral, acophate, vitamin E, peroxide, hydrochloride, vitamin B6, retinol, palamate, Radium. vitamin A, Red. Uh, cyan, silo, balmin, uh, vitamin B, pizza crust, enriched bleach, wheat, flour, flour, niacin, reduced iron, oh thamine, uh, mono, nitrate, riboflavin, folic acid, water, vegetable shortening, inter, inter, inter soy, uh, soybean oil, hydrogenated soybean oil, contains 2% uh, or less of 
sugar, salt, yeast, vegetable gums, corn, starch, gar gum, xanthian gum, oh potassium, uh, p -p 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 uh, I don't know, porphenate, I don't know. It says oh, in parentheses oh, oh. preservative. Um, uh, monoglycerides, uh, contains pizza sauce, uh, cornstarch, oh. salt, highly refined soybean oil, citric acid, garlic powder, onion powder, spices, preservatives, sodium benzate, potassium sorbate, xanthan gum, natural flavor, low moisture, part skim mozzarella cheese, cultured pasteurized part skim milk, salt enzymes, and my blend, contains milk, smoked, uncured pepperoni made with pork, no nitrates or nitrates added except for those naturally occurring, nitrates in sea salt, and cultured, uh, we're not done, uh, celery extract, pork, wow. uh, cane sugar, spice, paprika, cultured celery extract, paprika extract, garlic powder, cherry powder, rice concentrate, rice extract, lactic acid, starter culture, milk chocolate with puffed rice bar, and that's just a bunch of, okay, I, I'm, okay. That's what you're getting, okay? That's wow. it. It's everything. Wow. Now this one is called the pizza, okay? The pizza. Literally just the pizza. <sighs> Uncult uncured pepperoni and cheese pizza with prime hydration, cherry freeze, and feastables milk crunch bar. Keep refrigerated, okay, do not freeze. Nice. And then it says right here on the top here, gentlemen, if you can't read yeah. it, it says good taste, good, taste. good vibes. Ooh, real cheese. Open it, it, said, it says it's real. They, it says they have real cheese, and it says they have epic ingredients right there. Epic ingredients. Epic ingredients. Yeah, we just went through all the all epic right. ingredients. Now, we have Lunchables. Oh, don't. Here we go. And don't read. we have the extra cheesy pizza. Extra cheesy and pizza. And hundred percent freshness guaranteed. Thirteen grams of protein. And for the size, this is 330 calories, and this is 360 calories. Ooh. So, in fact, the pizza one is uh, more calories. Yeah. So, we've got the uh, Lunchables pizza yeah. as well. Uh, this okay, is. Just, just open uh, it. And it seems like it's pretty. Wait, well, let's open you, up. Alrighty. You make your own so, pizza? we have right here the pizza. Wow, what a surprise. They have wow. pizzas in here. And it seems like it's pretty good packaging. You've got the tomato stuff on the bottom there. It's underneath the pizza with the two different types of cheese right there on the side. And what? of course you have... That's a pizza. Oh. Oops. Yep. Um, I, I thought I could do it twice. Uh, this is the same one as yep. we just had, the Pacific Cooler. So since I already have one of those open, uh, we're just going to leave this one shut because we already have it. Yes. No, I want to see the... There is... Lunchables, or sorry. We have now the, the uh, Lunchables, or sorry, Lunchly pizza. And you have underneath why is, here, why does pizza there is, like oh, this is a very, very different strategy. So you've got the uh, uh, pepperonis What's right the there, thing? and then you oh, only have one okay. type of cheese, it okay. seems. Yeah, so while Lunchable has, has, has two different types of cheeses, I mean, it's uh, cheese. Lunchly only has one. Yeah. So we'll go ahead and take a look at Scam, yes. I guess so. And so now we have Prime Energy too. Cherry now let's go good. ahead and take a look at this. So this is a new type of Prime Energy. This is the third type of drink. It is called Cherry Freeze. Ooh, it's good. Okay, let's try it out. Shake it before you drink it. That's the first rule. Any drink, just shake it. Like Krosin. What, what is that face? He's gulping. It's good. It's pretty good. See? It's just sweet. Yes, yeah, pretty good. Water. Oh, uh, oh, uh, yeah. Paid actor. It doesn't really taste like anything else. Yeah. It's unique. Maybe it does, I just can't really tell. No, 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 it's unique. It's unique. Yeah. Uh, like it, one it, point it's has good. to be given to Prime. It's unique. Mm. I've never tasted anything like Prime, and I probably will never taste anything like Prime. It's not, it's not that bad. Like, Maybe I, I, I was actually expecting it to taste like shit. No, no, but no, it's good. Yeah, it's not so bad. Yeah. Uh, it does have a... <laughs> An aftertaste that's kind of odd. It's yeah. hard for me to explain, like, why. No, something, uh, something... But, yeah, it has, like, an interesting aftertaste. I don't really know what to say. Your throat. But, yeah. A little bit. Anyway, uh, yeah, salty. Yeah, oh, that goodness. might be... Oh, you think that's the lead? Oh, good. I never knew lead tasted so good. Maybe I should eat more of it. You have to. All right, let's do. go ahead and do...
And okay. yep, there. Uh, um, okay. Just, there we go. That's okay. pretty. I have to move my hands with pizza as well. Be able to. Give me a minute. Sorry. So we've small. Yeah, they're for kids, man. Yeah. So we've got ourselves our pizza. I feel like this is wow. about as good as it's gonna get. Call All righty, pizza. gentlemen. Okay. This is just like they do it in Italy, by the way. Yeah, sure. It looks like a clay pizza that uh, you know uh, those uh, young girls make with Play-Doh. This is an authentic Italian pizza. Authentic. All right, we're gonna take a bite out of it. We're gonna see what it's like. Come on. This is lunchables, right? Okay. Yeah, I think they have to cook it or microwave it. Ugh. I think he has to microwave it. That's what I said. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> it broke him. Oh, I forgot he chews a lot. There's a reason why I never ate these as a kid. Yeah. I'm pretty sure flavored cardboard would taste better than this. <laughs> it's not bad. Like... He's paid by lunch league. It's just not that good. It, it, it's, it's just not that good. Like, I, I never yeah. really liked it. I like the turkey ones. The turkey ones were my favorite. Okay. It's already Lunchables with a Prime? Yeah, I also, I, I really Lunchables have to say this again. Prime. They're basically oh, the same thing. Okay. okay? It's pretty much the same food. Except the drink. Like, I, like it's like 90% the same, maybe 10% different. Okay? Yeah. Cardboard. cardboard is greater than a microwave. I've never microwaved cardboard before. Maybe I should. Lunch. Yeah. Um, these pepperonis are extremely dry. Mm -hmm. I think he has. But to I like beef them. jerky, so I'll take it. It's okay. But they are extremely dry. Okay. Come on, taste it. I'm, so I, I pepperoni is usually reaction. dry. Yeah. Well, this one is it's definitely plastic. dry. Literally. All right. So we'll lean forward a little bit. Maybe this is going to make it easier for me, so I don't have to reach around. Okay, uh, I don't really like reach arounds generally. So okay. we've got also, uh, this is the Eucharist. The uh, in case anybody doesn't know, this is the uh, body of Christ. And so, uh, you know, if we eat this, uh, it is communion indeed. But anyway, uh, okay. it also could be known as a pizza crust as well, oh. if it's from Lunchly. So, uh... What the hell is happening? I don't know. I don't know how to feel about the way this smells. He's a rat. Okay. So now we're going to have... The sauce. Oh, man. This is a real piece of shit. Oh, oh. wow. What a fuck up. Yeah. Oh, jeez. It, what a mistake. Open, isn't it? Oh, God. How the fuck am I supposed to get this out? There's no tearing place. Rip it. There's no easy area for me to remove this from. Like, I think it's maybe here. Oh, yeah. Who's your teeth? Teeth? Yeah. yeah, funny thing about that. Yeah? Um, okay, so... I guess what we'll no do... Teeth, I forgot. Is, naturally, I have a box cutter. Go ahead and just cut it right through there. Alrighty. Okay. Good. Yeah, this kid's every kid brings his shank to school anyway nowadays. Actually, no, never mind. If it's America, it's a gun. That's only yeah. in London. Uh, so yeah, if you're in London, maybe you should get the pizza here. Yeah. And so anyway, we'll go ahead and we'll put the just uh, just, just shoot the uh, pizza sauce. We'll put the to open the, it. the sauce here. I don't like the way this sauce is. Okay. If I smell it, mm -hmm. do you want to know what it smells exactly like? A pizza sauce. The other sauce. Oh. It's the same thing. <laughs> yeah, it's wow. pretty much the same. It smells exactly the same. So, wait, if everything is almost the same, 
then why did mr beast ksi and logan paul just go crazy when they ate like lunchables they were vomiting all over the place they were puking almost how if it's the same they should be doing the same thing with lunch lease as well okay so we'll go ahead and put some of this on there that's a lot there we go and in this circumstance we're going to use one of the pepperonis we have multiple pepperonis yeah. we're just going to put this one on here we're going to have it moved around okay and i hope okay, that just... pepperoni is you know that would make lunch leave i think yeah so okay. eat it come on quick he's scared <laughs> Put it in your mouth and let God take care of it. Anyway, okay, yeah. let's do it. He just had flashbacks, a time lapse from his childhood till this point. Okay. I hate to say it. Is it better? I think this one's better. Wow. I do. Wow. I actually think this tastes better. Wow. Yeah. Um. Shit. Okay. No way. By how much? So the thickness yeah. of the pizza, I think, did play a factor. Mm -hmm. Because the middle of the crust of the Lunchables one yeah. didn't really taste as good. And I actually think this had more flavoring in it. Uh, yeah, for me personally, I think this one was better. And that was even without the pepperoni. Now let's oh. try it with the pepperoni. Here we go. More chemicals? Yeah, I guess so. All right, here we go. Just take a big bite. The pepperoni um, does smell like pepperoni. Oh. I'm a bit of a shocked. pepperoni expert myself. Oh. And I would say that, yes, it does smell indeed like pepperoni. Okay, eat it then. So that's good. I'm going to eat half of it and not the whole thing. Ah, Actually, so pepperonis are dried. It should be fine even if it was left out. He, he waffles a lot. Yeah. I have a nitpick. Yeah. Oh my god, he's still chewing. I think the pepperonis are too hard. Oh. And because they're so hard, they are better. you eat the pizza a lot faster and you, you mush it up a lot faster than the pepperoni does. And it's like the pizza is still there. Oh. Whereas, um... Oh, no, sorry, the I pepperoni still there, whereas the pizza's not. The pizza's gone, yeah, yeah, I understood. Yes. Sorry. Um. I'm gonna be real. Yeah, it, it tastes better without the pepperoni. I think the one true one is better. Okay. Wow. I do. W script. <laughs> I unironically think it's better. I like the pizza more. Yeah. Yeah, they paid him. It's a tie. Um. And this, by the way. Yeah. I would never choose to eat either one of these. Yeah, that we got because it. I like the uh, the turkey one more. Yeah, we got it. And this. that's my favorite. I don't really like either one of these pizza ones. But if you if you, you wanted to, to put one? me on an island, yeah. you know, and it's like you had to survive on these for a whole a whole month, yeah. uh, I would choose this one, right? Ooh. If I had to pick. Ooh. Does it count out to it? Yeah, the turkey one is fire. Yeah, I didn't really like the lunchly turkey one, but I think the lunchly pizza one is in fact better. Okay, then. So. It's not that bad. The, yeah, the new Mr. Beast video idea. That's a really good idea. Yeah, an island with no box cutter. So died, it's really funny because, died. like, this Lunchly right here takes a huge L for a reason that they never should. 
It's the fact that the packaging for the tomato sauce is annoying to open, and there's wow. not an easy way to open it. Whereas with the Lunchables tomato sauce, it was incredibly easy to use. It was very controlled, and with the Lunchly one, it was not like that <laughs> at all. That's, so that's if easy. I had to choose, I like assuming that the price was equal. It's not, by the way. Let's I would go to McDonald's. But um, <laughs> if, if I had to choose, Wait. I would go with the Lunchly. Yeah, it's not. Well, let's say it is. No, no, no. Let's not say it's it's the same price because it's not. Oh my God, it, it doesn't say. Just tell me the price of Lunchables. Okay, it's three eighty eight each. Okay, so they okay to be to be fair, there are a huge variety of Lunchable flavors, and every Lunchable, depending on the flavor, ranges from one dollar fifty. To three dollars eighty-eight. That's the max I'm seeing right here. Lunchly price eight pounds is what I saw. Okay, it's three ninety-nine. It's not eight pounds. Never mind. I mean, it's it's not it's not there. There is no big difference, even though lunchly is costlier, but it's not a big difference. But if you compare these flavors, I think Lunchables is one point five, and Lunchly is three eighty-eight. So. Yeah. Um, I think the lunchly one tastes better. So the pizza okay. one, uh, now it makes sense why they were pretty, uh, you know, outspoken about the pizza one, talking yeah. about the pizza one a whole lot. Okay. M what? Is there anything else? Common. Yeah, it's quite common. What's this? Oh. Has adjusted. Find it. Uh, a bone graph? No, that's... So I, I did have a different draw line. Right, that was me. That's I was him? like 17 then. Oh. And like now it's a lot different. It is. When did you start losing them? All oh, my teeth? Like at like uh, uh, 20. I started having my teeth fall out at 20. At 20? Yeah, I was like, uh, I, I still have that fucking shirt. But yeah, I was, uh, I was 16 then. I might have been 17 in this photo. I don't really remember. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. The teeth we can see look good. Yeah, yeah. Well, I had braces as a kid, so like my teeth were actually perfect for like two years, uh, and then they started falling then, out. Yep. Good. Really, it's such a big difference in appearance. Yeah, it is. No, it, it it's definitely a lot different. That's why people might not like really notice. But like, teeth yeah, to fall no. But as this, a kid, I, I looked way, way, right way, here. way different. I have to taste it myself. You want me to uh, get food poisoning? by tasting Lunchly and Lunchables. Subscribe to the channel so I can make some money, so I can put it because it's 1.5 in USA, not for me. For me, it's 800 rupees, which is almost $10. So yeah, anyway, subscribe. Thank you to Asman Gold for uh, giving us this amazing, amazing food review. Uh, subscribe to his channel as well. Uh, most probably you will come to my channel because you know him anyway but uh, if you know me and don't know him somehow then do watch his video subscribe to his uh, channel uh, his link would be down in the description this video uh, that's it I don't know what to say if if okay okay let's do this if this video gets 100 likes which is a lot a lot my video never got 100 likes ever before I think uh, excluding shorts so if this video gets 100 likes i am going to make a live stream where i taste expired prime there we go it's that prime is like probably two years old so i will taste that prime if this video gets 100 likes i'll i, I will drink expired prime seriously so if you want me to drink expired prime subscribe that's it subscribe peace